Just Cause 3 has a ton of secrets, easter eggs, hidden areas, and references. So let's go over 40 fun ones that you can find throughout Medici. In the village of Vico Platessa, in the corner of one of the buildings, you can find this gun known as the DK Pistol, which will inflate the heads of people you shoot with it, where you can get some fun interactions with enemies you kill while they have a big head. In the capital city, you can find a banana stand called Bolo's Original Banana Congeletta, which is not only a reference to Bolo Santosi from Just Cause 2, but also a reference to the top banana episode from Arrested Development. You can actually find Bolo Santosi herself playing a DJ set near Alba. You can find the Buster Sword from Final Fantasy sticking part way up the massive mountains. You can find a smoke monster pace around and kill three people before fleeing. This is a reference to the smoke monster from the Lost TV series. In the village of Soliana, you can find a small puppy in the area of the city with a lot of trash. When approaching the puppy, it will begin to follow you and you can lead it to the doghouse across the street. Upon doing so, you will unlock Doge Mode, which can be enabled in the gameplay menu, which will pop up Doge phrases when you shoot at people. Over at the Mistrali Province car race, you can find a landfill which contains a ton of retail copies of Just Cause as well as Just Cause 2 in it. You can find a bonfire with a sniper rifle sticking out of it, a reference to the bonfires from Dark Souls. You can find two women, one wearing a white slash gold dress and another wearing a black slash blue dress being a reference to the dress meme. In the western corner of Falco, you can find some ruins with statues circled around a dead goat. The statues will begin moving towards you if they are off screen, being a reference to the weeping angels from Doctor Who. You can find a couple of hidden teleporters around the map which will allow you to input a code to be teleported to other areas of the map. You can find a pogo stick in the capital city, which is in fact usable and pretty fun to mess around with. You can find the crashed wreckage of the Mile High Club from Just Cause 2 near the northern coast of Mistrali. There are a few special cows, one of which can be found near the Mile High Club wreckage that have blue horns. You can ride these cows and you do have a chance to fall off of them. You can find Thor's hammer Jonathan, also known as Mjolnir, inside of a large crater. You can find Mr. Snowman, who you originally meet in Just Cause 2. You can occasionally find a license plate that spells out Avalanche, the name of the studio that made the game. You can find a rubber ducky jet ski at the northeastern lake in Val de Mar, which you can ride on in the water. You can find a small car known as the Rocket, which is just a really random car that may be a reference to Mario Kart. You can find a few different football fields, or soccer fields if you will, with usable balls. You can find a group of mimes near Sancta Federico performing hand signals to each other. You can find the chair and beach umbrella that Rico sits on when you start the game in the northwestern volcano island. On this island you can also find a mountain that has a face resembling a skull. And you can also find a man wearing only underwear who seems to be stranded. You can find a couple of carousels around the map that you can activate. You can occasionally find a civilian that looks like Luigi. You can find a fish and crab store near a dock in Nacra called Just Claws, a play on Just Claws and crabs. You can also find a clothing store called Jazz Zombie and Fitz, which is a fun reference to Abercrombie and Fitch, but one of their advertisements is Just Jeans. At Dima's lab in Cava de Rubellas, you can find a blueprint of the Tuk Tuk Boom Boom, which is a vehicle from Just Cause 2. You can find computers that have the blue screen of death on the Eden airship. You can find a building in the old town of the capital city that emits opera music when you are near it. Rico will reload the U-24 Zabajak dual wielded shotguns in a similar way that the Terminator reloads in Terminator 2. Back to the title screen, the bottle of whiskey that Rico is drinking has a scorpion symbol on it which is the symbol for just cause. You can find a campsite that has caught on fire near Guardia Valdemar 3. You can find a fallen tree in Costa Sud with the initials M plus C and a heart around them carved into the tree. There is a fun Spongebob reference where you can occasionally get an Urga U17 Acrobat in the colors of yellow and cyan and the registration number will read Hoi Mioi which is a reference to Doodle Bob. You can find a tree in Val de Mar which has a man's face on it. You can find some computers inside of the Stingray base which resembles the 1982 computer Commodore 64 which is indeed historically accurate given the story that goes on with this base. You can also find pool toys on a shelf near the underwater entrance to the Stingray base. And finally, nearby you can find a sunken cargo ship that has a bunch of trapped rubber ducks inside of a box. 
If you can push the cardboard box and let it float to the surface and destroy the box, Rico will yell out, Freedom! Freedom! And here you go, 40 different secrets, easter eggs, references, and whatnot from Just Cause 3. This game has a ton of fun stuff hidden throughout the road, but these 40 are my 40 favorite ones you can find in the game. Let me know which secret is your favorite down in the comments. I hope you are taking good care of yourselves. Have a good one everyone.